The mission of Second Chance Equine Association is clear. We rescue, rehabilitate, and relocate horses to appropriate homes. Hi, I'm Scott Downs, and in this video series, we're going to document the progress of a young rescue horse named Fancy. When Fancy came to us, she was a year and a half old. She was malnourished, dehydrated, full of parasitic worms, and had a terrible case of rain rot. She has a great disposition, very sweet, but she is afraid of people. Our goal is to replace that fear element with respect and affection through leadership. I'm excited about taking this journey and I hope you come along for the ride. First thing we want to do is get the horse to move. So she's pointing that direction, right? Yeah, that direction. Let's go that direction. And what I want her to do so I want to put some pressure on her, and I want her into a canter because I'm going to get her attention this way. She slows down. I'll just put some more pressure on her. I'm keeping my eyes and my shoulders directly on her. Have you noticed her ears are cocked into me? She's paying attention. She's saying, what is going on here? You used to just give me biscuits and things, and now you're throwing something at me. What is this all about? I'm just establishing that I can move her feet. And in the horse world, that's exactly how you establish respect and leadership. It is the horse that can move the, the other horse's feet who is the boss. When she gets out there and runs around, this is as much exercise she has had in a long time. Isn't she fancy? And what I want her to do so I'm going to let her come down a little bit. I did put pressure on her. I'm going to take pressure off. The way I take pressure off is subtle. My eyes. Instead of looking at her directly, I start moving them down, away from her eyes, down to her back. I want her to slow down. I want her to start talking back to me. When a horse drops his head, it's a sign of submission. Next sign is when they start licking their lips. Well, I tell you, she knows what the point means. I mean, she, she figured that out pretty quick. What I want to do is now I just want to get her, her eyes, catch her eye. And as long as she's looking at me, I'll let her rest. And that's, that's, that's the beginning. You can let her rest. If she takes her eyes off me, I'm going to send her off. Now, that's very good. She may or may not come in on me. The strongest bond is going to be a mental bond. And you're going to let this horse decide on her own that she wants to be with you. Actually, I, what she, if she's standing, gives me two eyes, we'll let her rest. Head goes down. And we'll decide, she'll, she'll decide how much we do with her tonight. What I want to do is I'm going to pull around. I'm going to go to her hip with my pressure. The more you go to the hip, the more you get the head. There it is. That's good. Okay, and what I really want her to do, I just want a little bit more. All right, so we're going to just add a little bit more pressure. None of these tools are here to hurt the animal, just to encourage, maybe make her uncomfortable. Definitely protect yourself. Ah, girl. She can't change direction without you telling to. There's a drive line that I'm looking at right now. The drive line is from her withers to where her girth is. If I stand behind that drive line, I drive her forward. If I step in front of it, I encourage her to stop or change direction. So right now I'm behind it and I'm driving. That a girl. When we turn, that's what we want. I want her attention on the inside. 
The more we can turn, the more she's thinking. Good girl. Pretty soon she's going to start to notice that on the outside she's doing a lot of work. When she stops and gives me two eyes or comes in, she's going to get rewarded with some rest and good loving. In the very beginning, if you remember, we're going to have to rewind the tape. She's looking outside, you know, trying to escape. Now she's paying attention. There you go. Oh, excellent. It's nice. That's all I want right there. And notice she gets closer and closer to the center. All right, look at me. Yes. Now you're going to rest. I'm not going to come into her. I'm not going to change my body. Right now I want her to connect that if she's looking at me, she can rest. Aren't you pretty? There we go. Good girl. Yeah, you want to, don't you? Sure you do. Yeah, you do. Good girl. Oh, yeah. Wow. Huh? Come on. I'm not chasing you. You want to go? Go. I'll let her at that. You know, I mean, that's, she, she's now getting it. She's now beginning to connect. After all that running around, huh?